Hello everyone, my name is Trinity Aronaut and today I would like to cover with you the Slink Deluxe Female Foot Pack with Dynamic Feet. Um, when you buy, uh, you know, normally I, don't know about you, but I don't like changing feet because it's a pain in the butt. You have to go in, you have to find the inventory, you have to bring it out, you have to change out the feet. But with this HUD system, you do not have to do that. That is one of the beauties of the Slink Abby Hance Feet Female Deluxe Pack. Uh, instead, you can simply add the feet and you really don't need to remove them. And because you don't need to remove them, you can choose to wear a uh, Matreya foot when you, when, when you want Matreya shoes. You can wear a slink foot when you want slink shoes. And also the beauty of this deluxe pack is that a Matreya offers three different heights. And that's nice. It really is. But slink offers five. So let me show you the pack. When you open it up, this is how you get it. You've got, uh, clearly you've got um, uh, feet here for, not only for uh, mesh uh, bodies, but also classic bodies. Uh, that would be the, uh, uh, the blenders for the skin. And um, you also have a, a, feet, a foot coloring system, which um, is great. It's not anywhere near nice as the actual foot system. Uh, that, uh, that that skin makers make. So I actually bought a skin, uh, a, a foot, a, a slink foot applier from, um, from uh, Details, which is my skin. And uh, it was only, it was less than 200 lindens. So I went ahead and colored it. So when I put these on, you will uh, not notice a difference, which I really love. I love a seamless look. So the beauty of this is that we can remove the feet simply by making them invisible. So let's make, go ahead and make our, our, our Matreya feet invisible. Then we are going to add the foot to, and there's only one, which is really nice. You don't have to do two of them. And we're going to put the HUD on. So basically you, do, you wear two things out of this box. You add the HUD and you add the feet and you will make those feet visible. Check that out. So basically if you want them visible you can click on the feet themselves. If you want them invisible you can click on the off button. And then if you want to wear a Matreya foot, you can simply add the feet back and then you've got Matreya. If you want to wear a slink foot, you can click the, the, that link and then um, you can go ahead and add your feet back. Now, like I said, Matreya only has three feet, but if you look at this HUD, you will see there are five different versions. You've got the flat, like Matreya does. You've got the medium high, which Matreya also has, and you've got the high, which Matreya has. But this is a very cool thing. You also have the the like medium flat, which is great for short um, for for short heels and uh, sandals and th those kinds of things. And also a nicer look than the flat feet. And this is the kicker. You've also got the point, which is beautiful for, um, uh, um, for ballerina shoes and ballet and point shoes. So, that's what we've got here, and, and, and that is really great. And this shoe, this actually foot is what I was looking for, and I love it. Now, you may notice that you can have your uh, nails on or off. 
You can have your tattoos on or off. You can have your socks on or off. And you can have the lock on or off. Now, I lock this via um, another lock, so I don't need to worry about this lock being on now. Uh, but if you don't have any other locks, you can certainly use that and lock them, lock the ankles, which is very, very nice. You all might also want to notice that you have several different manicures here, which is really, really nice. And this, this is so cool. So you have some, uh, you have some uh, natural looking ones. You've also got some beautiful, elegant manicures and then get this you've also got the chipped ones with the chips on the end that is so nice here hold on this is this is one you see the ones with the little chips on the end of the nails it just has that kind of realistic look to it which is very very nice and there you go so that's how it's done. Now you also have several sizes. You can have, you can, for example, put your feet in large, which doesn't actually l enlarge the feet. Instead, it enlarges this area up here where the foot meets the leg. You see how that looks. You can go medium. You can go small. And that almost fits my foot, but the extra small makes it absolutely flawless look at that now if for example you're looking around at these feet and they seem to fit but you're finding a little bit of a gap just between uh the foot and the leg then you just want to make it maybe a bit smaller maybe take it down one or even take it uh, probably not up one because that would make the gap larger and if you have shoes that uh need to see the feet and the heel but you're, you're, you feel like your, your lower ankles and your lower leg are a little too wide for the feet and you've got uh, the mesh sticking out, you can simply remove the, the, that lower leg. And sure enough, your, your a boot or your shoe will look flawless. There we go. So put it back on. And that would be there. Very good. Okay, so if you want to do something to all of your feet, for example, you can choose all, and that will give you the choice to remove your uh, nails or, or leave them on. Very nice. And... Um, Now the beauty of this hand tab is that you can actually use either buy a new deluxe package with 12 hands or you can update some of your old hands. I have old hands that I had purchased, I don't know, two, two maybe two and a half years ago and I went ahead and updated all of these hands. So you can literally use these hands and you can put out a HUD here and I'm going to choose this HUD here and you have a choice. You actually put the, uh, the, put the gestures in here and you literally have a d dynamic hands. Now, this is good if you have old hands that you really want to turn dynamic. You've purchased them, you've spent your money on them, you'd really like to see uh, them moving and, and, and actually uh, working with your poses and that kind of thing and your AOs, but you don't want to spend money on, an, on new hands. And I don't know about you, but some of these bodies are like 5,000 lindens. And uh, if you've got old hands and uh, you want to spring for a mesh body that's a little less expensive, as well as the feet, you can go slink. And you can get, if you've got old hands and uh, 
and even old feet you could do still do that but if you um if you have if you purchase the the dynamic feet in this HUD you can see you've got five different versions of feet and uh, you can actually get away maybe a little cheaper if you purchase one of the uh, uh, physique or the hourglass bodies and uh, use your old hands and um, and just grab one of these dynamic um, deluxe kits for the feet you can also turn in those old hands and go ahead and get uh, this particular, uh, the all these updated so that they're dynamic, and then you can add them all into this HUD, and um, you can turn them. You know they will move and adjust, just like anything any any other hand would do. That's uh, that's bento. So there you go. Now the beauty of this system is that the hands even the old ones and certainly the newer ones the deluxe ones where you have 12 different hand shapes um, the beauty of them is that they're linked so when you say have the green uh, nails on your hands you can also see that they go onto your feet if you turn your feet if you t do your feet to black then you also have your nails at black which is really very very nice and uh, you can also see that on the hands you have got three different sizes but that is not all now I'm not sure how much of this comes in the hand HUD uh, I think um, probably uh, this uh, this comes in as well. If you look, you can see that you've got a stiletto HUD in here as well. So not only do you have these three sizes, but you have three more sizes. So let's go ahead and add on the stilettos, and you can see that you can add them together on both nails or you can do each nail separately if for example you need to hide one hand like you might have a coat or a sweater that goes over one shoulder and you need to hide the entire arm and hand you can do nails only on the hand you're not hiding which is very nice and that is not something that um, Matreya offers I actually had an incident where I had a coat that I'd slung over one arm and Indeed, I had to take the nails off both sides and put on uh, other nails because uh, if you, you can't take one hand off. So anyway, um, let's let's look at this. So go ahead and when you when you put the HUD on, you're going to see that you've got three sizes. You've got the short ones, pointy ones. You've got the medium pointy ones. Let me slide in here so you can see this. And you've got the short ones. You've got the, sorry, you've got the short ones. You've got the medium ones. And you've got the long ones. Now, the stilettos would equate to uh, coffin nails or um, or or you know whatever it is that they're called in the Matreya. Now this comes separately uh, as a HUD within the hands but I'm not sure I suspect though that if you get the deluxe HUD those would all be together. I could be mistaken though I, I don't honestly know. So anyway and get this the really cool thing about this is it will literally use your manicures. You can use all your old manicures, your old slink stuff, your new slink stuff. So I'm going to give you an example of something new. I'm going to do um, Casme. And I'm going to do the nails. I'm going to do the um, top up. I'm going to do the slink nails and we'll pick something obvious.
So this is Slink, and you can see that not only do they work on the nails, they also work on the stiletto nails, and when you put them on the nails, they go on the feet by default. So this is a very, very easy system, and you get, you get two extra feet heights with it, which is also very, very nice. Now, I want to show you how you can not only wear feet that, um, that are new, but you can also wear feet that are old. Of course, you've got the toes digging in, and that would be, f that is fine, because the beauty of this is, I can show you now, is that each one of these heights come with their own shoe base. So, when you want to wear the toes, you can put on the toe base. And when you want to put on the high feet or the flat feet, you can put on all of these different bases, which is very nice, because it saves you from having to readjust your height all the time. Let me show you a, uh, a, a foot for the point. Um, that's going to be a new shoe. So let me find a new shoe. Okay. Here's an example of a newer shoe that will fit this beautifully. And as you can see, it's already got a stilet, uh, a, a um, point stiletto uh, shape with it. So that means you don't even need to go into back into the um, um, uh, the, the the folder to get it because you can put it on right from within the shoe folder. Very, very nice. So that is a stiletto. Now let's say you want high feet. So this would be the shoe you would wear. And go ahead and remove this other shoe. And And you can see, you still got your point, but if you go in here and instead change it to high, you will see that that foot fits perfectly. Okay, let's try flats. You can see that flats don't fit on these feet, except if you take them out of high feet and put them into this, into flat feet, you have a second pair of shoes. Um, uh, I mean, you have a different pair of shoes, which is very nice. And you see, you can use all your old slink feet as well as your new Matreya feet. Very nice. Only feet you will not be able to use are your Belize feet. Any, any, I mean, the only shoes you, the only shoes you will not be able to use are your Belize shoes, unless of course you've got Belize. And uh, I'm honestly not sure how this works with Belize um, feet. Um, you'd have to see if the Belize. I don't know. I've not actually pulled out my Belize body in a while, so I don't know whether or not the heat the feet hide as opposed to come off. If they hide, then I'm assuming you can use your feet with Belize the same way 
it, you're using it here with the Maitreya. So that's it. And that's everything. I think that's everything for feet. Let me make sure I covered everything here on hands. And the beauty of this is if you go ahead and you get the, um, get the, uh, uh, the deluxe HUD for the hands as well, you've got 12 hands, you've got 12 feet. They are pretty much carefree. They really are. And the beauty of them is that you can also use them for, a they, they cover AOs whenever you want them. They will uh, go with bento AOs. They go with bento uh, poses. They're just really, really nice feet. And quite frankly, I think the upgraded hands are kind of nice too. So that's me, Trinity Aeronaut. And I am going to let you enjoy the rest of your evening. If you enjoyed this video and you found it informative, please make sure you like it at, down at the bottom, down, down where, down the little um, like button, and also uh, join my, um, go ahead and join my, my uh, page while, while, by subscribing to it. And I've got plenty more tutorials and reviews of, of events. And I've got powder packs and Lux boxes. You name it, I am one busy girl. Anyway, <laughs> thank you for watching this video. video and bye-bye.